guys, it's Emma, Megan, and Ariel. Today we're going to be reviewing the Aspen Override subscription box. And this is the back to school edition. We're just going to be opening it up and giving you guys a review on everything that's inside of it and telling you guys our honest opinions and stuff. There are two types of boxes. One is a VIA box, a very important Aspenista, which is $49 a month. And then we have the regular box, which is $15 a month. All right, now onto the video. Yep, so this is what the box looks like. And once you open it, the first thing you're going to see is this card, and it has all of the items that are in the box and what Aspen's opinion is on all of them. So after opening the box, um, you just see a bunch of pink confetti that's super cute. And then the first product is this lip balm that is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula. It's a uh, in Juicy Watermelon. And I don't know, it looks really cute. It kind of reminds me of EOS um, Chapstick. But we're just going to open it up and test it out. Alright, so... That's so cute how it opens. Oh my okay. god! Is... Alright, so we're sisters and she's our best friend, so we don't <laughs> mind sharing chapstick. <laughs> it's very tasty. <laughs> it's really smooth. Yeah. It smells really good too. <laughs> I actually really like that. I, I think, do too. I think yeah. I'm gonna use that like a lot. And it smells really good. It reminds me of a, a watermelon airhead. Yeah. It does. Mm. It does. It tastes taste really like good. an airhead or a Jolly Rancher. Yeah, so we really like this. Give it a thumbs up. We give it a thumbs up. Okay, so the next item that's on the list is these Goody Girl cookies. They're chocolate chip cookies. And they have quinoa in them, which is Ooh. interesting. Wow, mm -hmm. and they're naturally gluten free. <laughs> They kind of taste like burnt, okay. The texture, it doesn't taste like a burnt cookie, but it the texture of a burnt cookie that's been la left out for a while, that's crunchy. It kind of tastes like a burnt cookie. It does. But, I mean, if I was gonna be healthy, I might buy it, but I'm not. So what are our overall thoughts? I'd eat them. I probably wouldn't. If somebody handed them to me and they were like, here, you can have these, and I was hungry, I would eat them, but I wouldn't go out of my way to buy them. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I'm not I wouldn't have them. The aftertaste isn't really good. <laughs> that good. So the next item in the box is some toothpaste by the brand Hello, and it's just a widening toothpaste. So we're gonna try it out. Yeah, I think it's a cool concept, like to whiten as you brush your teeth. It's like less steps, like between using like whitening strips or doing a treatment on your teeth. Yeah, and another thing is it's naturally friendly. So I think that it could be helpful for sensitive teeth. And it also says it prevents cavities, strengthens enamels, freshens breath, and feels awesome. And the packaging is really cute as well. I think it's going to be a gradual whitening experience. Um, I will say though, I don't like the taste of the toothpaste. So the next item I see is a product by Benefit, and it's actually two, two of their, um, one of the mascara and then the other one is a lash primer, a tinted lash primer. So I've used like the, their real mascara before, it's just a mini one, and I really like it, but I've never tried the primer, I've never tried any kind of lash primer, so. Yeah, I didn't even think of a lash primer like existed. Yeah, <laughs> I guess it's a thing. It sounds kind of weird and kind of useless, but I guess if it really works. I think it's really awesome how small it is as well because it's good for traveling. Yeah, and it also has like these three pictures of like before and after and I can already tell it makes a huge difference. So we're going to go test these out for you guys and we'll insert a clip and just give you guys our opinions. <laughs> So I really liked the primer for like a natural look. Um, it really made my eyelashes look longer. But the mascara, I feel like it's just like any other ma mascara. Um, I feel like you could use any mascara on top of the primer, or you could just use the mascara by itself, like normal. But if you want to go for a natural look, I would recommend getting the primer. So the next thing I see in the box is a Derma E Purifying Daily Detox Scrub. It's also travel size, so that's really convenient if you'd like to travel a lot and you don't want to get like a big size um, detox scrub. 
I think it's really cool. It's natural skincare solutions. So it could have natural ingredients. Yeah, so I already have um, pretty clear skin, but I think this will be great for just like an extra cleanse every now and then. Yeah, we're gonna try it out and let you guys know how we feel after. So this is actually pretty cool. I like that it has the charcoal in it. It just like, it feels like it's very refreshing and just like kind of opened up my pores and it was a really good scrub. So this other thing that's in the box is just this tiny little pin. I guess it's kind of cute. It's like a camera. Oh, it is cute. I don't know if you collect pins. Some people collect them on their purses or like hats or something. Okay, the next thing in the box is, it's this water bottle. It's called the Zing Anything Citrus Zinger. So basically you can like, it's kind of cool if you like to infuse your water, but you can cut up a lemon or an orange or any kind of citrusy fruit and put water in it. And I think it filters to the water. So it like, it says you press, twist, and infuse. You could also put like sweet tea and then put lemons in. Oh, that's a good idea. I like the style of the cup. It's really convenient. You can like hook it onto any backpack with this and um, the only downfall I would say about this cup is if you put ice in it, this cup's pretty small. It's about the size of your hand. Um, you wouldn't have a lot of liquid in it. So yeah, I've never had fruit infused water before. I guess it sounds good. Normally I like to have lemon slices in my water. I think this would be fun to try out. So yeah, we're going to give this a try. It's a cool idea. I think it's like a two-in-one type thing. Alright, so I put the lemon in and shook it all up, so now I'm going to try it. It's alright. It just tastes like lemon water. It looks kind of weird, like, I don't know, it doesn't look really pretty. The top looks pretty, the bottom looks weird. The last item I see in the box is a, is a Hydro Cool Firming Eye Gels. It's by the brand Skine Iceland. Um, it helps firm and depuff within minutes. So you just put the peels under your eyes and you set them up there for 10 minutes and then gently peel them off and then hopefully your under eye will be more firm and less puffy in the morning. Yeah, so normally when I wake up in the morning my eyes are always puffy or I have under eyes so I'm really excited to give this a try. I don't know, it seems kind of interesting so I think we're going to test it out and let you guys know if it really works and if we think like what we like it. So after taking these off, I feel like under here is like really warm and it feels like I feel cleansed and kind of like it did make them like a little firmer, but I've never really had a problem with under eye circles or bags or puffiness. Um, another thing I will say though about this is if you, you know, if you don't like this very much, I know there's a tip that my mom and I use a lot is we'll put um, spoons in the freezer overnight and then in the morning we'll put them under our eye and it helps the puffiness and firms our skin better. Oh, cool. So that was everything in the box. Um, it says online that the value of the regular box is up to $30. So um, we got a pretty large amount of things in the box. So I think it actually, it, either $30 or more than $30 worth of stuff. What do y'all think? <laughs> Um, honestly, like, I probably wouldn't use that water bottle or the eye diffusers or, yeah, yeah probably half the stuff. And I you didn't... hated the cookies. Yeah, so. I hated the cookies. I don't know if it's worth $15 a month. I feel like it would have been better that you could just see what's in a box and buy that box if you want a month. But, yeah, it's kind of like it's a kinda surprise. Kinda, yeah. so. The box is really good. Um, most of the stuff I probably wouldn't use either, um, but I really like eyelashes, so I would definitely get the um, primer and then the mascara. Alright, so that was all of our opinions on the box, and I hope y'all enjoyed watching what we thought. So yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you like it, and don't forget to subscribe to see more videos in the future. Melon, like, thing where you, like, make lemonade. Is that called? <laughs> Pause real quick because those are disgusting. I've never finished them. Oh.
Do it in your mouth? Yeah. That's really gross. Did, did you, you like, like it? it? Honest opinion. <laughs> did you like it? We all said like, did you like it? Okay. I liked it.